What's up, Ant City, and welcome back to another episode of Demon Slayer the Hino Kami Chronicles. And today, we've got another, they've been pumping out these updates like crazy, but we got another update adding more demons to the game, which we got Enmu and Yushiro. So we got two more demons in the game right now. They, they've been pumping out these updates like crazy. Today's video is going to be about Enmu, though because i've actually been practicing him and i think that he's my second favorite demon P possibly he's up there with akaza for me i really like the way he plays so today's video is going to be focused on him and then the next one will be tamayo and the other one so yeah let's just hop in to a match now all right so we got our first match here with a zenitsu and a shinobu so before we start talking about enmu and how he plays and stuff one thing you might notice right away this match is actually in 60 frames yep they I guess I, I don't know if they were just finalizing it with the last update or whatever but they actually now have the option to have 60 frame matches online so I'm I'm very excited about that being like you know a content creator all my videos about to look so like beautiful so yeah I'm definitely here for that but um yeah so that, that's one thing that they kind of just shadow dropped that though because I don't know if they even announced it in the like you know when you start up the game and it tells you about the DLC I don't think that that was announced that the game's running 60 frames online now but i mean i'm fine with it. it it's not every match though did we just win oh my god that was quick so it's not every round that runs in 60 frame though i think that i don't know exactly how it works but i think both people have to have the setting on for it to work because i've run into a few matches that were still in 30 frames so yeah but let's talk about enmu so the reason enmu is one of my favorite characters is he just has i would say he has a pretty diverse moveset obviously he's more of a ranged character but he's not as ranged as, like, Yahaba and uh, the, the last two demons. I, I keep forgetting their names. But Yahaba and the other one, the Tamari demon. He So Enmu, to me, is more of a middle ground there. He's got really good range and, like, traps and everything. But he's not f solely focused on range. And I think that I like... That's, that's like, one thing I really like about his character. Like, it, you can see it during the matches right now. Like, even, like this like i don't know what you call these like guts or whatever that he pulls up the ground for his attacks those have some pretty good range but he can also be a good character to attack someone up close so yeah wow we just won a second round that's crazy but yeah he's really good for those reasons uh like i i would say he's like a mid-range character like he doesn't have crazy range he can have some pretty good range and like moves that can like trap your enemy like this move his down like you see that little aura i have there that's actually a trap so it'll linger around until like it eventually goes off and it can hit enemies pretty easily. Is this guy not here? Um Hello? Oh, okay, he's back finally. Uh, I don't know what happened there, but I guess he, he had to leave for something. I don't know. I kind of feel bad though cuz I did like a lot of damage on him already, but it's fine. So, one other thing with Enmu that I've actually already used a few times. You want to see? Oh, we can get the ult here. Watch this. So yeah, th this is another thing I like. You could combo into his ult easy. This will actually might kill, I think. Like I said, I do feel a little bad because we did take out like half of his health bar uh, before he got back, but I didn't know he was gone. But his ult, Enmu's ult looks so cool. I love, like, it's not like Akaza's ult, in my opinion. Akaza's ult is like the best demon ult, but Enmu's looks really good. So we'll get into the next round, and I'll talk about what I was going to say at the end of this round. So yeah. Okay, so I decided to give this guy a rematch because, again, like I did kind of take out half his health bar. And I feel a little bad, so I decided to let him have a rematch. Bro, the next thing I was going to talk about with Enmu that's really good is his grab. I think his grab has the most range in the game. Like, look at this. Okay, well, I just got hit. So I'll show it off when I can. But his grab is ridiculous. Like, look, you can kind of... Let me do a little combo here. Just to show off how big of a reach it has. You might have seen it a few times in the last match, but I just want to show it off again here. Look look at that range look at how far out that goes it's ridiculous so you can use it in like a lot of situations like look i can just do a little combo here 
Well, yeah, look look at how far out that reaches. Like, his grab is insane. If you play Enmu, you have to use that grab because it, it's such a good tool that he has. Like, yeah, that's why I said Enmu might be up there for, like, my favorite demon in the game. I do still like Akaza a lot. But Enmu is, like, it, he's just fun, man. <laughs> like, oh, my gosh. So, yeah, like I said, that grab, though, is just insane. <laughs> it's Like, let's see if we can kill with it here. Oh, I timed it wrong. Otherwise, that would have worked. <laughs> that grab is insane like yeah that's another that's just one thing with enmu and like i said i did practice a little bit with him so i'm probably doing better than i did with the last two demons because uh you know with like uh yahaba and susamaru i'm definitely doing better than i did with them just because enmu is more of like my play style that i like you know i don't like yahaba and susamaru they probably are good i just don't know how to use them Enmu though, like yeah, this, yeah, this is the type of character I need. Like he, like I said, he's kind of somewhere in the middle of being ranged, but also up close. I think he has good tools for both, so that's why I really just like it, like the way he plays in this game. Ooh, grabbed <laughs> that grab. Like like I said, his grab is crazy. It's one of my favorite moves to do with him. And then yeah, he has all these traps and stuff. You could just really pressure your opponent easy with him. Look at that. We just set up two traps. That might actually might kill him. Oh, he blocked. Oh, I ran out of energy. Oh, the perfect block. Let's go. That was insane. That perfect block. Let's try to get the ult again. Also, he has really good assist moves. So let's use this one, for example. This one's got a range. And if your enemy's within the range, I think it's unblockable. And they get, like, hit, like, guaranteed, basically. Like, it does a stun. The only thing is the combo will be a red combo. And what I mean is, like, you see the little wheel that pops up? Let's, let me start a combo real quick. So you see the little wheel over there on the right, how it's yellow? That basically is a timer for how long your combo can go. So blue is like the longest combo, yellow is a uh, medium, and then red is the shortest combo. So if I hit this move, oh, he has to be standing for it. Let me try it again. Oh, he's out of my range. Oh, he fell into it. So you see when I start a combo, it's a red combo. So that's the one thing that's not good about it, but it's a good way to stun your opponent is what I will say about it. So yeah. Oh, you surged. Okay. Oh, he's dead. Oh, he blocked. Good job. Nice block. Nice. I thought he was dead for sure, but nope, he did manage to block. Ooh. Yeah, he's going to beat up Shinobu a little bit. Oh, he went through. He went through. Oh, he ran out of energy. I would have been dead if he still had energy there. Woo! Did I hit him? No, I did it way too late. Let's do it one more time. <laughs> Got him. I don't think it's going to kill, though. It's only a level one. His ult looks so cool, too. Like, look at this. He'll never wake up again. And then we just throw, like, eyeball guts at him. Like, bro. <laughs> Oh, it actually killed? What? Huh? <laughs> that killed? At that much health? I thought, like, he would be low. I thought he was going to have... You see how much health I have? That's how much I thought he was going to be left with. But it actually just killed. Wow. Okay, that does a lot of damage. I guess it's because it was raw and I didn't combo into it. But still. Well, uh, we're going to do one more round in this video. So, yeah. Okay, so this vi this round actually, if you already notice it, this is a good example of what I was talking about. So this match is actually only in 30 frames. So my theory on why that is, is he, I think that he doesn't have the 60 frame setting on. I don't know why he wouldn't. But I think that that's, I think the way you connect 60 frames online is both people have to have it activated. Because that would make sense. So if one person has 30 frames, then it automatically defaults to that. Or perhaps it's just like the connection isn't good enough to run 30 frames or 60 frames on this. So, yeah, this is like a good way to show. It is kind of jarring, though, that some rounds are going to be 60 and then some are down to 30. That's kind of weird, like, you know, for like watching and even just playing it. But, I mean, that's just how it is. And... Okay, sorry, I had to cut out around there. I got a little interrupted, but... Yeah, but like I was saying, it is just a little jarring that some rounds are going to be 60 frames and some are in 30, but yeah, so. But Enmu, like I said, he is really good in this game, especially this grab. Like, this is insane. I, I don't know who thought this was okay, okay but yeah, 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 just apparently they did, so they are insane, whoever made this character. But I mean, based on like the character uh, roster, though, because they added two more demons, uh, but based on the way the roster is looking, I think we're going to get one more. I don't know who it's supposed to be, though. I know there was leaks a while ago, and so far all the leaks have been accurate. Um, so I don't know who else we're supposed to get. I'll look into it and maybe put, like, a picture or something or, like, show the leaks and stuff. But I don't know if it's... I don't think it's Muzon. That would be cool, but I don't think it is Muzon. Because he doesn't really fight in the anime, right? 
and I don't think they're trying to spoil the manga. I haven't read the manga either, so don't spoil, please don't spoil the manga. But yeah, so I don't know who else we're getting for demons in this game. Uh, uh though, I suppose the audio lagged right there. Hold on, y'all hear that too? Sorry if it is lagging, but um, yeah. So we we're supposed to apparently be getting one more demon. I don't know who though. So I guess we'll find out. Get in my range, okay? Nope. Bro, I also have domain expansion, just like Akaza. Bro, he's just hopping around like a little bunny rabbit. But, yeah, I, I wonder who the last demon is. I gotta look into the leaks again, but... I'm assuming they're gonna be fun to play, though. That is one thing I will say about the demons. Is, all of them aren't for me. Like, the two new... Like, the two... The last two that came out. The Susamaru and Yahaba. They're not really for me, but if you like playing ranged in this game, they're like the perfect character for you. So I will say that they have been doing a good job at giving us a variety when it comes to the demons, but uh, like I, th I think it's really cool that they've just been giving us a good variety. Like Akaza is all about just rushing and attacking. Um, Rui is all about like setting traps and all that kind of stuff. Uh, I'd say Enmu is like in between Rui and Akaza, in my opinion, from what I've played. But you know, I'm, I'm no professional at this game, you know, but just... From what I oh no, <laughs> that might actually kill me. Cause it's, yeah, it's a level three. I'm dead. Well, yeah, he called his grandpa up to watch me get bodied. But anyways, guys, that was it for this video of Demon Slayer the Hinokami Chronicles. Like I said, I'm having a lot of fun with Enmu right now. Might go play him some more, but we do got to try out the other demon as well. So that'll be in the next video, though. So thank you all for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. If you did, make sure you hit that like button and that subscribe button. And if you really like this video, like a lot, like more than normal, make sure you share it around to your grandma, your grandpa, your manager, your co-workers, whoever you want to share it to. And... If you really, really like this video, you might consider going down and putting it into your favorites playlist. But yeah, that's it for me. So until next time, I'll see you all later. And peace. Have a good day or night, y'all.